There is no clinic in the Netherlands where repair operations are performed. But in Serbia, Professor Miroslav Djordjevic specializes in transgender reversal operations. In recent years, he has operated on 14 regret patients. In the meantime, 60 new patients have registered with him. Are there any cases from Holland? I cannot tell you. Sorry. If you have a male who uh, passed transition, wrong transition, and who has now regret, uh, we have to create, a, uh, again, male genitalia. And for this reason, we have to find a good and enough material to create a neophallus, scrotums, and testicles. So, for example, for phalloplasty, we use a piece of uh, uh, arm or of the back or the leg to create a neophallus. After that, we use uh, some uh, uh, different tissue, for example, oral mucosa or uh, bladder mucosa or maybe some other parts of the skin to create a very long urethral channel. And also we use some implants, like a penile implants, to enable uh, erection after reconstruction of the neophallus, also testicular implants. Multiple operations are required to complete the recovery. The entire process can take up to one and a half years. However, no genitals can be reconstructed yet, with which patients can have a satisfying sex life again. And for this reason, we started to research about possibility for penile transplant surgery. It means if we have, for example, 1.5 million transgender persons in Western Europe registered, we have almost half and half male to female, female to male. If we have 700,000 male to female, we are going during a surgery to cut, to remove 700,000 penises and to put in the garbage. So my life, my life uh, motto, my uh, biggest uh, vision is to collect all, all organs, to save the organs, not to put to the garbage, uterus, ovaries, testicles, penises, and then collect this, create a bank in Europe, and then use some of these organs for better results, for better functioning, to help the, another person who really needs this.